Okay, so our goal in a regression model is to capture relationship between these explanatory x variables and the dependent variable y as accurately as possible because essentially these x variables contain some information which we believe is useful in uh, estimating this y variable. Sometimes we do not write our model properly hence our x variables on the right hand side do not show a proper relationship between x variables and y variable and this type of problem is called functional form misspecification and it occurs when our model does not capture the true relationship between y and x variables let me show you an example suppose our true model is this and uh, say the relationship between y and x is uh, quadratic which means uh, it may have a relationship like this but instead we estimate a model like this model so this is this estimated model right so our estimated model in this case is suffering from the problem of uh, misspecification right so this is the question should x's be appearing in uh, square or higher order terms or we should include axes only in uh, the linear form let me show you an example in r okay so in this example we are looking at this crime data set and uh, we are modeling economic model of crime that we saw earlier in this uh, example i'm going to estimate this model without uh, quadratic terms and then i'm going to include all the quadratic terms of all of these explanatory variables in my second model and then I'm going to show you both results uh, side by side to see what is the difference between uh, these two models so we can see that each of the quadratic term that we included in the model is statistically significant which means probably we should be including these quadratic terms in the model the other thing we can do is we can test for the joint hypothesis that whether these quadratic terms are statistically significant jointly and we can apply this f test the f test value is about 31.40 and the p value is very close to zero which means that we reject our null hypothesis that these quadratic terms are jointly insignificant and conclude that at least one of these is statistically significant we conclude that our initial model without these quadratic terms overlooked some potential non-linearities those can be captured by the quadratic terms so essentially our model was looking something like this red line and we were modeling it like the black line so this is how you can test for functional form misspecification using an f test in the next video i'm going to introduce you to reset or ramsey regression specification error test to test for functional form misspecification and i'm going to give you an example of that all right i'll see you in the next video bye bye